Hello parents or observers of students. Do you need help logging into Echo and navigating the homepage so you can see how your student is doing in his or her classes? Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is get your school's Echo URL. Each school has a unique Echo domain and therefore has its own unique URL. Once you get this from your student's school, you should bookmark it. Type in that URL so you can get to the Echo homepage. Now that you are to the Echo login screen, you should see a place where you can type your username and your password. Each parent or observer has their own unique username and password. Once you have typed in the correct information, hit enter. The student you have been selected to observe will pop up in the next screen. If you are observing multiple students, select the student you want to look at now. This will take you to your student's home page. Now you are able to see all of the courses your student is enrolled in. Let's start talking about how to navigate the home page using the main menu. The main menu is right over here in the upper left hand corner. When you open it up, you have a few options. If you have more than one student that you are an observer for, you can click choose student, which will allow you to switch back and forth between the students you are observing. Anytime you are anywhere in Echo, you can always come to the home button and that will take you back to this home page. You can click grades, to see an overview of all course grades for your student. You can see any communication the instructor has pushed out for all your students' courses, like an announcement. You can also see your student's calendar, which will have upcoming events and due dates of assignments. From the main menu, you can also see every course that your student is, is enrolled in. If you click on a course, it will give you two options. Here you can either click the activities button to see all course activities that your student will have to complete, or you can click on the grade book icon to see a breakdown of your student's grade for this specific course. From the main menu, you also have access to the Echo Help Desk. If you have an echo question or you need support, you can click right here on this question mark and type in your question. You will be redirected to our Echo Help Center where there are many documents to support your echo questions. Let's go through the basic navigation outside of the main menu. Let's click the home button to go back to our home page. If you want to see activities or tasks within each course that your student needs to complete, has already completed, or is working on now, you can click the Activities tab. If you want to see your student's grades for that course, you'll click the Gradebook icon and it will take you straight to the gradebook with a breakdown of your student's activities for this course. At the top of the screen, there are three tabs. The Courses tab, which allows you to see what you see now, your homepage with all of your students' course cards. You have the To-Do List, which gives a list of activities your students need to complete, things that are due soon or things that are past due. And there's also the Activity Stream tab. This gives you recent announcements from the teacher, recent activity due dates, upcoming or past events, and communication from the teacher. Let's take a second to talk about the gradebook for each course. Choose a course you would like to explore and go ahead and enter that course clicking the gradebook icon. Here you will see an overview of your student's grade in this course right here as well as how they are performing in relation to the learning outcomes in this course. So this is their gradebook dashboard. Go ahead and click the Grades tab. Now you will be able to see each task that has been assigned to your student in this course, as well as their score in relation to each assignment. 
if as you will see the score as long as it has been graded by the teacher. So this assignment could have been done and just has not been graded yet. So you will only see the score if it's been graded. Also, you can see badges that your student has earned in the course. You can see their activity stream, which, go, which also compo is compiled of announcements and upcoming events. And you can also see your student's to-do list for this course. So right now, the student has nothing that is currently due. But if they did have an activity that was due, you would be able to see this right here on their to-do list. Let's go ahead and navigate back to our home page. And that is it. Now you know how to navigate the Echo homepage as a parent or an observer.